Well, hello everyone, Dylan here with another LEGO Sonic the Hedgehog review, and this one's on... And this one's on Sonic's Speed Sphere Challenge, my horse. So in the front of the box here, we which have uh, the LEGO Sonic the Hedgehog logos and border that we've seen on, that we see on all the set boxes. And then picture of everything that there is with Green Hill Zone in the background and Recommended ages is six and up, set number seven six nine nine zero, and also two hundred ninety two pieces. Then on the back of the box, so we have kind of another arrangement of the set and a couple of set picks, and also the speed sphere, and also all the logos again and everything in there. And now onto the manual. Which kind of an odd rendering, like we see on most manuals lately. Well, like most manuals, of course. Or since last year, whatever. And here we have, and also advertisement of transitioning to paper bags and add for the builder app. And on the back, how to win on the online survey. All the pieces that come with the set. Advertisement of all the sets that there are. And expect reviews. Expect reviews on these two when I get when I can get them possibly. But yeah. And then the last building steps. First off are the mini figs. Or a mini fig and a half. First I have Sonic the Hedgehog himself, which as you see for the headpiece and well everything about him, same as from the 2016 Dimensions pack, well or Dimensions Fun pack of course, but except it has side shoe printing, like in the ideas set of course. And also back torso printing, also the same as in that one, but also in this version, also comes in a couple other sets of this line. And of course that's the same smirk expression, of course. And also do have a blue flicky here, which is kind of similar to ones that kind of comes in some of the other sets, but yeah. Although kind of odd how we have just Sonic here, but of course, although would be nice if Knuckles or whoever could have also been included here, but all oh, maybe that would have been a little much, but whatever. And now, oh, hang on. Now, on to a moto bug, which looking kind of about like it does in the games. Or, uh, and also, since this line's kind of a mix of minifigs and brick built figs. Things, unlike the Mario line, of course. But however, the face part of which kind of similar to the Buzz Bug, like we've seen in the uh, Tornado Workshop set. But it also have the Exo Force hand pieces used as antennas, but in yellow. So that was great for mocking, of course. And besides, which do have the Star Wars lightsaber hilt pieces, but as acting as like greebles, of course, and curved slope pieces on the back of which, giving it the round effect to it, and inside which has kind of a large hollow space to it, and like some of these, oh, a way to hold little critters into a course, but yeah. And that's about it there. And then also get our just three of these of the kind of recent style ring pieces like we see on like we saw in the uh, uh, tornado workshop set as well but in but they're just straight on the dish pieces instead of on the on clear uh, pole connectors but yeah oh, and also what you get is the nuke style sphere piece here. If you notice, it's in two halves. 
So how is this like? And of course, how this works like is you take your Sonic mini thing, place him halfway in, well with his arms risen up like that, and then take the other half with pins in it and connect into it, and he's in the sphere like so. And I'm not sure if these pieces are new to this theme, but or maybe they did appear in other themes. Uh, I'm not sure, but whatever. But also included with is this little launcher part of which also kind of also in the largest set of this wave, but at least kind of this in which probably the cheap way to get it. Which as you see it's comprised of mostly a few technic beams and bits of course. But also another one half of the the uh, sphere speed sphere piece, but is in red with a printed star piece on it. And so how it works like is that you just okay. That you can take this speed sphere, load it into it, and just smash down on it and it flings right out. So quite powerfully, which really good. Anyways, off away from that. Also, to get this one little side build that is oh, whoops, kind of a warm beach, part of which all of which you can kind of use in some like city uh, walks or whatever. Like the usual little chair with some uh, teal plate pieces, kind of nice to see there. And also a little uh, table here with a hot dog bun piece, like we saw in that has been introduced in Angry Birds line, but or Angry Birds movie line, sorry, but also, and of course, this representing the chili dogs that Sonic always likes to have around, but yeah, and also have the umbrella piece made of a few dish pieces simply, but yeah, that's about it there, and also along with it is this little crate kind of piece, but, or little camp, cabinet type piece, but yeah, but inside which do get two clear uh, studs representing ice cubes and also a can of chaos cola yeah chaos cola and of course like that like we see on some other things but yeah and now also do get this little DJ system which is the same exact palm tree build like we saw on uh, Amy's Animal Rescue Island uh, set, of course, and also do get a couple large amps with silver uh, dish pieces on them, like we see in some other themes, of course. And then as for the turntable here, has those uh, angular pieces, but in blue, nice to see there, and a couple, and also do get a couple of dish pieces, but used as records with uh, with the sonic symbol on it and of course a couple studs to the sides in both gr green and red and all resting on this uh, indoor style plate piece but in lime green which is good for mocking of course and also then if I also get this little archway oh whoops and of course one good call of it is perfect symmetry and of course like the flower piece over here which is sitting on just one stud and you can position it on either side if you wanted and built kind of similarly to the one in the Amy's uh, Animal Island rescue set of course but however for this top part of which which does have a few uh, jumper uh, tiles on all of them, and also a life monitor that has the power up of extra rings, of course. And of course, all of which resting on the uh, more curved plates, uh, which acting as the extra green grass of that. But yeah, that's about it there. And then last of which is this ramp. 
which comprise of that with these two traditional ramp pieces like we've seen in a recent LEGO City set, of course. And also a whole bunch of 2x4 bricks resting on a jumper tile pieces. There's each of which kind of separately to the top part, which does have a, a clear diamond piece representing another Chaos Emerald, of course. And of course, and the rest of the part of which does some more one by two uh, bricks in dark brown and darkish tan, to op obviously representing the pixelated bit of it. Now to see this whole set in action, or how it goes like. Maybe angle a little more. Press on it, and well. Sort of kind of made it through. Actually, I think I'll be better now. Or I should have pressed it harder. All right, one more time. There we go. So, as you see, this set with that launching feature quite fun for how it is. So now, let me get everything together, and we'll call it a day. So, for my overall verdict is, this is a quite good uh, set, quite, really good set. Like, quite, all the way, quite small and still quite fun for how it is, even though in separate segments to it, of course, which barely seem much nowadays, but yeah. But although for the price point of it, $35 kind of steep for it, although 30 would have been just perfect, but although still kind of workable, but yeah. Although, if anything could have brought it down a bit was getting rid of this uh, side beach part of it. And then, then it'd be just fine at 30, but what, what can you do? Although it would have been nice if an extra critter piece could have been included to like both be on the bug and also operate the DJ system, but whatever. And But as it is, this would still quite good and also a good starter for or starter set of the Sonic theme. Yeah, but yeah. And if you have it, and so now if you like have very little money and are looking to get any set of wit of the Sonic theme, then definitely get this set. And if you are looking to, or if you are looking to complete the Sonic theme or get this for your Sonic collection anyways, then also definitely get this set. But yeah, and that is about it with this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.